Volunteers in York County rolling up their sleeves and getting their hands dirty. Yeah, they're repairing 150 bicycles at a local shop, but not to sell. Fox 43's Grace Grifferton joining us now with more about the cause. Evan Alley, it's a tradition at Gung Ho Bikes in Manchester Township that dates back five years now. Pizza, beers, and bikes one night every December. A few hours of some volunteers' time bringing those in need some holiday cheer. It's not usually this noisy this time of year at Gung Ho Bikes in Manchester Township. We're not tremendously busy. You've been here and there's the second customer that has walked in. So what are all these people doing here? I know how to do some basic fixing. I'm not the best bike mechanic in the world, but yes, but we can, can take, I can take this one and we'll get it working and make sure it's safe. Yes. Volunteers like David Raymond giving up their time to give 150 bikes the love they need. The problem is going to be up here. And so I might have to take this apart to see if I can fix it. They won't be able to fix every single one. But they'll certainly try because these bikes aren't being bought. They're being given to a number of charities in York County, a tradition that goes back five years now, carried out each December. It just grew out of people were leaving, you know, we were ending up with bikes and we didn't know what to do with the bikes that we had ended up with. Whether they are cleaning out their garage or whether somebody, you know, they're just trying to make space for this, that or the other thing, or they just don't need them or outgrew them or whatever. People like Karen Neff driving an hour from Maryland to donate hers. I thought what better way, you know, to get rid of our old bikes and hopefully have, you know, someone else can get better use out of it. The owners wouldn't exactly call this a labor of love, but rather giving neighbors a lift when they need it the most. If somebody does have a bike, I mean, the joy of riding a bike is just one of those things I can't imagine not experiencing. The owners say come Friday morning at 10 a.m. the store will be very busy because all 150 bikes will be picked up by a number of charities across your county. They say the magic happens though when a child gets their first bike or an adult has a new way to get to work. Allie.